Hey guys, it's Emmy here and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to find worlds um, in, with the new VRChat interface, um, but let's go! So recently, um, or a bit ago, VRChat uh, brought in a new interface for VRChat um, and I quite like how it looks. I think a lot, it looks a lot more clean um, and once you get used to it, it is actually a lot easier to find certain things, um, but I thought today I would do an updated video on how to find worlds um, and stuff just because it looks a bit different and it can be a little bit tricky finding things um, when you're sort of new to it um, but let's go okay so first we're gonna want to go to worlds down here now let's first start off with my worlds um, if you press down this arrow key I recommend you generally keep this down um, just because it's sometimes a little bit hidden um, but here you can see your recently visited um, and then your home will be down there uh, so, so, so this will be handy if you recently went into world and you're like oh I want to go back in there and I want to save it or something um, it'll be here and these are updated favorites. These are worlds that are in your favorited lists, but they've recently been updated uh, So it's a pretty nice feature and um, then down here. We have all your playlists um, of worlds of like maybe saved worlds or anything. So these will be um, Here uh, we'll now have featured worlds. There's the VR chats variety box um, So you might find some nice worlds here. There's some fun games that you can have a look at um, Then there's the trending page uh, with which these all the trending and sort of big worlds uh, This hasn't changed since the last interface or anything So this is a good place to sort of find worlds and you know go in and chat and stuff then there's spotlight um, this will be, this will depend if you're on PC or if you're in a headset or something. Um, I'm on my PC at the moment because it's easy to film, um, but this will probably change if you're on Oculus or something. Um, but there are these ones here for Spotlight for PC and then there's Spotlight for cross-platform, which I generally recommend having a look at these ones, um, because you can meet people with, like, in different headsets or different places. I honestly think this place is better with more variety. Um, and there's some really fun games here. Then there's new, so these are new worlds that have popped up um, and that VRChat's promoting. Uh, so I definitely recommend you have a look at that. And then there's Rambo there, we're gonna ignore that. Um, then there's uh, Community Lab worlds. These are ones that can possibly be dodge because these are just ones that people have randomly made and are still in testing and stuff. So you can have a look at that if you'd like to. Um, then there's random worlds. These are just very, it's in the name, incredibly random that people have just made and uh, no specific views or anything, but you can have a look at that. Uh, then there's updated recently. It's like the updated uh, favorites, but these are just literally any world um, here. So you can have a look through that. There's active cross-platform, so cross-platform worlds that are really popular. Uh, so you can have a look through that. Um, active on my platform, so I'm on my PC at the moment. So these are worlds that are active from PC. Then they have Avatar World here, which you can find in the Avatar section as well. Um, then this one, I don't think this was in the old interface. I may honestly have not seen or anything. Um, but these are game worlds, so these are worlds you can play games in and stuff, which I think is really good if you're looking to not just like sit around and stare at yourself in the mirror and actually want to play some games. So this is a nice little, um, category and then there are classics these are the ones who which have been around for like ages um and are just like the main the main focus of vr chats with people um and yeah so that's the whole sort of world section then up here you'll see your current world that you're in so if you're in a world and you want to save it you can come here um and then there's search worlds uh this is in the search bar over here or you can press it um, here. They've recently changed the search interface, which I really like, for quick world searches. Um, this is really handy, especially for people who are on headset, because every single time I have to type on headset, it is really annoying. So this is handy if I'm just looking for something quick and I can go through and have a look. Um, so this is really nice. Um, but yeah, so hope you liked this video. If you did, uh, feel free to like and subscribe and comment down below if, if you have any other video suggestions like me to do or anything you're struggling in with VR chat that I can do a video on. Um, but yeah, uh, see you later. Bye!